Alright, congratulations, Jose Shorty Torres, the champ, champ defending his title successfully, Titan FC flyweight. Jose, man, I mean, what's next? I mean, they, they have to come knocking at your doors at UFC, it's time. You know, they've been calling me a couple times. It's either I'm injured or people don't want to fight me. I had two UFC fighters and I called, you know what? I don't want to call, I want a contract. And that contract's for UFC Chicago. That's my next plan, that's my biggest goal. And you know, that's my holy grail, so hopefully, fingers crossed. What do you think is the reason why they're just holding you back? I and mean, you've impressed everyone here in Titan FC. What is there more for you to do? You know, I really don't know. You know, I had the amateur resume, something that's never been heard of before. People have never fought someone like me. 7 0, 5. Pretty much main cards, four main events, three title defenses with two belts. I mean, it's definitely unheard of. So I, it's more of a question of why is the UFC hasn't signed me yet? So Chicago, your hometown, and they're building up this pay-per-view to be a very big one in the summer. Uh, you could be on it. This is, this, this is the card you want to be on. Yes. That's, that's a card whether I want to debut or not. I mean, I haven't fought Chicago in over five plus years. As an amateur, I started to get better. And, I need to, you know, be a big fish in different ponds, and so I started to travel different states, different countries, and and they're becoming a multiple-time world champion because of it. Chicago is my holy ground, it's my mass square garden. That's the place that has helped raise me, make me the, the short I am today. So I want to show people that Chicago's on the map, and I want to be there to do it. And that fight card, of course, we still don't know the exact uh, all the fights and so forth. But there's been rumors that CM Punk may be in that fight card with the likes of Floyd Mayweather, that's the rumor. What are your thoughts on that? What, what would happen if CM Punk you know, were to, co to fight with Floyd Mayweather? I'm not a fan of it, but hey, if it brings fans, if it brings attention, it brings people to the neighborhood, a beautiful neighborhood of Chicago, then so be it. I'm more happy, and if I'm on the card, that makes it that much better. As a, as a fan, who do you see this coming out, Money Mayweather or CM Punk? Oh man, actually, you know what? Surprisingly, I would see Floyd Mayweather taking it. I just don't see him being uh, timid in the beginning. If he gets taken down, obviously that's his problem, but can CM Punk really wrestle the whole, the whole person down? We haven't been able to see that. He has been training MMA, but Floyd Mayweather is the best for a reason. He is very diverse. He might be just a boxer, but you never know what his MMA game is like. So now you're training an American top team here in Coconut Creek, Florida. How, how's that experience been? What was the decision to come here? Man, it's, been, it's, it's probably one of the best decisions I've ever made. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous gym, super convenient, everything's in the house. I mean, I honestly can't complain, and they've taken care of me so much. I've been training with Pedro Munoz, you know, uh, Hen and Burrell, Jusir Formiga. I mean, so many top-level guys, and, and they, they're working on all my weaknesses. I honestly can't complain, and playing here in the hometown of Florida America Top Team, it's, it's really amazing to have now a home crowd to, to be supporting me. And, Again, it means the world that American Top Team take care of me now. So are you staying here or do you fly to Chicago or just have your camp um, here in Florida? So right now it's just my camp, but I'm definitely collaborating with Combat Dome, my home gym master Bob Shermer, and American Top Team together. We are collaborating together and I'll definitely be back here in actually almost a week to you know keep me, you know, my weight down, stay close to weight and just be ready just in case something comes up. If not, help these guys get ready for their fights. Now, you know, you're 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 a champion in two divisions here. What weight class would you like to compete in the UFC and any any individual there that you think you would like to get a, get a shot at? As much as I'd love the bantamweight division because it's so much easier to make weight, the flyweight division is where I'm at. You know, I've only had three fights as a professional at flyweight, and they've all been knockouts. I feel like that's a that's a saying right there, and the reason why I stay at the flyweight division. This is the Roman Show.